And welcome back to another episode of Hippy Dippy! So we're playing, we're gonna do, um, uh, how much you'll look after her. Tell us what she needs to for herself. Of course I'll look after you. I don't mind a bit, cause I want to have this! Five, five, what is it, a five something now? Cause we want fuck Granny! We want fuck the business lady! We want fuck you and we want fuck the idol! Even though the idol has a fucking problem! In fact, it would be my pleasure a fucking the shit out of you! <laughs> I kiss Cosmos again. Mwah! Mwah! What the fuck am I doing with my life? <laughs> and she sighs against my mouth. Sighs against my mouth. Her, uh, our tongues brush together and I... I taste uh, her saliva. It's very sweet, just like the rest of Cosmos. You don't have to go into fucking detail, jackass! Still, I draw my lips away from Cosmos and smile sh sheepishly. I'm sure a lot of people be surprised to know that succubus have so many concerns. I guess we all have to work to make a living in this world, huh? Hmm, that's right! We might be different species, but we're not fairies to Miller. What the fuck does that word mean? Some succubi look down on humans. They treat them like lesser beings. Our princess included. So there ended up being the SM bullshit. But I think those succubis are wrong. You humans are important too. You don't have the powers we do. You're all working to make ends meet. Yeah, that's true. We are working up our ass! Especially with my fucking content! I like how tenacious you are. It's adorable. Admirable. Oh, thank you. Even though I know you can punch a hole through my fucking stomach! And I think you're admirable too. You might be a hard, to a hard time with work. Don't give up. I'll believe in you. Heroku, thanks. I'll do my best to believe in me too. I was feeling kind of down after receiving that message from my boss, but this com conversation with Cosmos has helped flip my negativity, negative feelings around. Woo! She's a succubus and, a and I'm a human, but we're both doing our best to achieve our goals. In the past, I, I stressed over my job on my own. I didn't have a girlfriend or any close friends to confine in. But now I have Cosmos, Inu, and Maria. I'm not alone. Ah! Uh, a lot of people are cheering me up on, and I don't want to let them down. And Heroku, one more thing! What is it? Well... I don't want you to think I'm jealous or anything. That isn't it. You might be my boyfriend, but I don't mind if having an open relationship. I know Maria and then you love you, and I don't want to tell you apart from them. They're my sisters too. Though we're not related by blood, I also love them. I would be happy if we could all be happy together, but that's right, you should be wary of me. She's more aggressive than she looks. Ooh, she's gonna pin me down? Pin me down on the ground, tie me to the bed? Fucking whip me into shape? <laughs> I'm just joking. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck this place is doing to me! <laughs> if, if, you give her a chance, she'll make a move on you. Don't let your guard down, or you could end up in, up her slave. I do it! I fucking called it! <laughs> she isn't an FBDSM! Would he really, really try to do something like that? She seems so nice. She may seem nice, but look, can be the saving. You should be careful, Roku, with that woman around. You might be in danger. I don't know what's the fault. Don't ta be taken in by her sweet savade. You have to keep in mind that she's an a actress. 
and she's much, much better at hiding her true intentions than Inu. Yeah, true. And that's what I like about Inu right now. We don't know about Hifumi, but I guarantee you that... I guarantee you that, um... She's, Cosmos is probably right about her. At least Inu has at least some tensions of being a better person. So that's a good thing. Despite Cosmos warning, the rest of the day passes without an, an event. See Hifumi for the whole evening. If Hifumi does, does want to make me her slave, Sure is playing of the long game. Oh god. Does she really want that though? It seems out of character coming from such a mild-mannered woman. I can't imagine he for me playing the role of the dom of the dominatrix. That role is far better than suited for Maria. Mar yes, Marina has the sexy skimp outfit, which we knew, which we found out in the first game of Marina, which she hasn't been in this playthrough. She hasn't been in the second game for a while. It's just been Cosmos and fucking the new girl, Hifumi. Well, whether Hifumi has a dark side or not, it seems my time, Soroka, will be more interesting than I anticipated. What's gonna happen? The following day passes quite like the previous one. I'm roused by the, the smell of Hifumi's wonderful cooking and eat. Delicious breakfast prepared by her hands. Then I go for a walk. Not that Roku's gone this time, but I, but in the sprawling countryside around it. I take photographs of my leisure using my phone and idle away the hours among the embrace of nature. Ah, you gotta love nature, man. Nature is really interesting, but I'm afraid of bugs, but it's so beautiful to look at. To be honest with you, that's what I like about nature. It's really peaceful. Getting out of the city sure is relaxing. The air is nice and clean and the sky is so blue. The weather has been great throughout my stay. I only hope it holds up. Wait, did I go back? Holds up, okay. I went backwards because I didn't know what that was doing. In a few days, I'll have to go back to Tokyo. I doubt I'll see him from me again after that. Oh, dude, now if you not play one of these playthroughs, you're gonna see her again. Trust me. If she does, if she does want to make me hers, have to make a start on her nefarious plans. I don't know, but I can't see that happening anytime soon. Are Anu and Cosmos paranoid? Being the youngest of the Succubus clan. Oh great, now they're a clan? What's next? You're gonna be a fucking cult! I mean, there's some four fucking games left! There's probably gonna be a fifth one when they're... <laughs> it makes sense they'll feel threatened by an older, beautiful, more experienced Succubus. I guess they don't know Hifumi as well as they know Maria. So they're on their guard. Maria, Marina, 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 I can't fucking speak! I don't know if I'm saying it right. For her heart part, seems pretty close to you for me. She didn't make any unpleasant incidental? I don't know, about her character. Well, then again, Maria is also into that BDSM. No, I'm gonna fucking loot outfits! It really is a mystery. I feel like the days are going by like really fast. That night, I decided to go out to for a dip in the hot springs. The weather and water of the springs is nothing sort of luxurious, and I'm sure it will help me clear my head. I make my way to the changing room by my wooden sandals clacking against the toppy tondi mats. I don't know hallway. I don't know what the hell that word is. I know it's fucking floor. The Tommy Mats, there we go. When I arrived, I stripped off my clothes and wrapped my a towel about my waist. Then I get 
set up for the private mixed gender hot springs book for us. Oh, mixed gender, okay. Hot springs is a secluded one local, a brief walk away from the male and female baths. It's a pleasant spot. Things lined with damp rocks, the air thick with steam. The water itself. Oh god, I'm gonna see the girls in fucking naked! Crystalline. I can see the moon reflected in the surface and all the stars. A cold breeze tugs in the, my thin towel and I shiver. Alright, that's enough admiring the scenery. I, if I don't get set into the water, I'll get, catch a cold. I reach for my towel around my waist, ready to relinquish it. Oh my! I thought I would be alone out here! Who is this, huh? A tingling bell-like voice makes my me grip my towel tired about me. There's someone else in the springs. Judging by your tone of voice, it's a woman. Who is it? Their voice does does sound familiar, but in of a, such in a panic state, I can't think of who it might be. I'm a man at night, intruding upon a young woman, and we're all alone. This is a sexual harassment charge in the making. <laughs> what you said was a mixed bath, so you know what's going to happen. I could s say it's an accident, but who would believe me? I'm in the hot water here. There's literally, not literally, not yet. Oh, uh -huh. oh I'm very sorry. I bow deeply. Not that a mysterious woman can see me and clench my, well, a bit tighter. If it was Cosmos Marina in the hot springs, I wouldn't care about my nakedness, but I don't want to strip off to have a complete stranger. I should probably get going fast before I get accused of being suspicious. I'm not the one at fault here. This is a private hot springs. Maria booked it specifically for the four of us. There shouldn't be anyone else here. Who is the mysterious person bathing in the hot springs? If only the steam wasn't so thick, I might be able to see them better. As it is, all I can make of it is a velcro outline. I can see the curves of a smooth back, white a puppet clean. And long black trench is. Could it be? That voice switched, but apology just now. I believe it belonged to a man. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. This is quite a conundrum. Has a Brandon come to steal my virtue? That would be quite unfortunate. Please, I beg you, if you wish to have your way with me, do so quickly and do. Not prolong the torture process. Now, what's this person blabbling on about? No, you got the wrong idea. I haven't come to take advantage of you or anything. I did. I don't even know who you are. I thought this bath was empty. I swear. This is all a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding? The woman blinks through the fog at me. So you do not wish to embrace me? No, that's no, that's the last thing I want. I'm not a criminal. Oh, I see. Now that is a pity. How is it a pity? Shouldn't you be relieved? You, the one crying out about your chastity just now. But of course, women must be modest about these kinds of things. It wouldn't. To, to cry, take me, please, to the first intruder comes along. But engaging in a thrust beneath- She wants to have sex here. What the fuck? Are you fucking stupid brain dead? She wants to- Your fucking dick inside her! <laughs> uh, light in the moon with a mysterious uh, assailant does sound somewhat romantic. It sounds like something from a novel! I ha a heavy sigh. Woe is me! I'm so disappointed! I went to all the effort to come here. Private hot springs where nobody 
Over here are our moments of passion. So she does know she's intruding. Was this calculated from the very beginning? Yeah, you do not not even wish to take advantage of this situation? What sort of man are you? I am not attractive enough to light the tender sire within your breasts. Within your breast? What? That makes no fucking sense! I don't- The guy- Well, the guys do have breasts, but this is just fucking ridiculous. I can't really say it's so steamy I can't see your face. And I cannot see yours. Step forth, please, so that I may see you more clearly. I would like to know with what gentleman I have a converse, conversing turn me down. I really don't think that's a good idea. I turn, ready to leave, but then a cold gesture of wind blows. It's the leaves and the trees and the further short well, that that's wound around my waist. It parts the worst of the steam now. Now I find I can finally see. The woman hand in the hot springs is none other than Yes Bandic Beauty, how the fuck is this achieving? She's got a big ass. I could stare at this picture all fucking day. I'm gonna take a screenshot of it. <laughs> there we go! <laughs> I'm a fucking pervert! Son of a bitch! <laughs> He for me! My, my! He for me smiles. She doesn't seem all at all embarrassed about her earlier in, in utterances. And neither does she seem that surprised to see me. Does she know I was here all along? I'm starting to wonder. Hey, he for me, why were you teasing me? Now, now, I whatever guess gave you that idea. You were the, you were one of my dear fans, and I'm very uh, appreciative towards you. I would never making you feel uncomfortable. Yeah, you're gonna whip me into shape of the sex dungeon, bitch. I fucking know it. <laughs> or so she says, but her smile doesn't waver. Maybe because what's in you were right about her. After all, she isn't the demire and delicate lady I thought she was. Right, well, uh, I glanced away from you from these awkward awkwardly. It's hard to meet my idol and I when she's wearing nothing more than a fucking towel. Fuck! My dick is getting rock hard! No! <laughs> I should probably go now. I don't want to bother you. Huh? Oh no, don't leave! Stick it in me, bad boy! <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with me, man? God help me for the love of God! <laughs> this ain't gonna get monetized, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> the whole entire fucking. The last fucking playthrough they get fucking monetized. Though we were are sharing the same logging at the present, I've been so busy attending my chores, I haven't the chance to speak to you all day. That you found me, quite, quite by chance, I might add, must be faith way, faith's way of saying we ought, no, we ought not be parted. Would you care to sit with me and dip your feet in the, in the warm water? It should help eliminate uh, the cold. It's blank night. Jeez, he for me stop talking. It's so fancy. She sounds like she comes from a different era. Her Japanese is very refined and polite. Well, yeah, because she's lived longer. That's the whole problem. I mean, uh, we already established that she's older than the other three girls that we've met. I could get swept up in her melody cadence of her voice. You know what the one thing about this playthrough that I'm starting to like? 
There are some words that I don't fucking know what the fuck they mean! So I'm actually learning some English here. <laughs> Which is a good thing! She, I, uh, thinking... I'm gonna go save it. What, um, her offer certainly sounds tempting. I came to the spring so I could relax in the water, but will I really be able to relax by taking me by my side? Besides, something about Hifumi's words doesn't sit right with me. You said our meeting was by chance? You said, oh, you said, what else could it be other than the whims of faith? The, this is proof that we were simply meant to be together. Hee hee hee! She wants your fucking dick, dude! Run! You're gonna get locked up in the sex dungeon for days! You need to go to- <laughs> She's gonna whip you in the shape, boy! Fucking run! Yeah, right. Sucky by might have inserted themselves into one's or ordinary existence, but I still don't believe in faith. It's too vague and unscientific. Didn't you just say that you came here into this private hospital on purpose? Oh, did I? Yes, you did, bitch! Yes! Yes, you did. You know you did. You said you came here on purpose so that nobody could hear our well. You should have known when you came here that this wasn't the regular woman's hot spring. You weren't hopping, hoping to run into me, were you? Now that's quite an accusation! What would uh, you do if I answered your allegation in the positive? Would you be disappointed in me, Roku? Would you think me think me helpless, this wicked? Even stop being my fan? What? What? No, of course not. Your ass is so fucking huge to want to suck it. What the fuck? This is what this prisoner's doing to me. I remember the last fucking blood sucker, sucker face. Did 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 the same fucking shit. But you sound so serious! You might make me feel as though I've done something wrong! Tee hee! Stick your finger up my butt, oh b ass big boy! Like, what the fuck am I doing?! Why?! <laughs> I'm having too much fun here! And all I'm doing is fucking reading! <laughs> Technically, you did something. You did do something wrong. You trespassed in these private springs booked for us. But I wouldn't hold it against you. You just want to know the truth. Did you really come here to meet me? My, my, you're... Sh you are a sharp one, aren't you? Well, great. Now we know that all the second best... Well, suck our dick! We're fucking screwed! Leave me slap. <laughs> That was like an evil laugh, to be honest with you. Yes, that is right! I knew full well that this hot spring was a private one. I am trespassing, I'll admit it. But I had no, but I did so only because I wished to see once more. It feels like it has been so long since last we spoke. I missed you. I saw you like five, like, what the fuck? You missed me? Wait, what? Yes, indeed! Now that's hard to praise. I can't imagine the famous actress Yamato missing me. It's insane that she- Wait, 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 wait. Is she the one that we dated, like, back in high school? It just dawned on me, man. It is- It's insane that she went out of her way to speak to me thought she'll stoop to such underhanded methods. 
It's a well-mannered woman. Well, when, <laughs> but maybe Inu and Cosmos were right about her. She's more de divisive than she looks. I'm fired, but why do you miss me? I'm nothing special. Ta-ta! Why is your finger in my direction? You may have suffered for lying, but that does not give you carte blemish to do so yourself. What do you mean? What do you mean? I mean there that you are not being entirely truthful either. You say that. You say you are not special, but it's untrue. It is a blatant falsehood. If we were not special, Maria not have taken such an interest in you, nor Cosmos or nor in you. This fact alone has made me curious about you. I can't fucking speak my mouth for fucking Ugh! I need a drink of water, hold on. God damn it man, I'm scraping up a lung! Ah, oh, that was good. Alright, I get to join! For the four minutes! My sisters are awfully picky when it comes to, to men. It's rare that they all agreement on anything. Yeah, I can believe that. <laughs> yeah, I have to fight a lot! You know, are always are always at one another's throats. They want grip each other's heads up! It often falls upon Maria as, as their in, 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 in dictator. I don't know if I'm saying that wrong. They're all succubi, but in terms of taste and personality, they're quite dis disalarm. I don't know. They all seem to love you, though Inyo and Cosmos are particularly smitten. Yeah, Maria's never been in this part. She was in the part once. The way they thought fought over your affection the night was quite the sight. I surprised but also impressed but happy too. Oh, okay. I was pleased for Cosmos. She's always been so awkward. I fear she would find a suitable partner. And Inu's too wild can be quite can be quite difficult. She's bad at admitting her true feelings, and she's frightens frightens people away. Yes, that is true. Both of them have their coins, and she notices it. Ifumi knows that she is a really smart person. I've never seen her care for anybody quite Brazilian before. I'm not Brazilian. I feel like a, a proud big sister. I'm so glad my aunt, naughty her siblings have grown up and discovered what love is. I thought to myself, but it made me want to know more about you, too. If Cosmos and Nino adore you, then it must be special. Yeah, because of my fucking dick! I had hoped we could speak more. I might just discern how special you are. I see. I can understand he for me's interest at least. But now I'm beginning to wonder if I'm disappointed in her. Tell me she shouldn't get her hopes up. Uh all right, we'll stop it here. Man, you know what the one thing I have a problem with this, these games is the menu fucking thing. So, we're gonna... So this will be the next part. Next part will be answering the fucking questions like a fucking jack jackass. Hope you guys have a nice positive day and take fucking care, bitches!
I'm getting lightheaded, so I'm gonna stop recording. Excuse me, my apologies. Cause I've recorded a bunch of parts. <laughs> Excuse me, Jesus Christ! Sorry, my apologies. It's water. I've been drinking water lately. It's not soda, so I apologize. Hope you guys have a nice positive day. And take care! We want to so fuck that ass up! Bounce that ass up! It's a song from the fucking mid-2000s! I think.